two years. That's how long it took for the Fremont County to renovate their jail. Local News 8's Braden Wilson takes us inside the facility. It's been 40 years since Fremont County could say they have a new jail facility. But after two years of hard work, they can say that again. Our security is definitely upgraded as well from our control panels to our doors to every every aspect of technology. We're, we're going to electronic tablets, so it minimizes inmate movement and security issues. The new jail is an add-on to the existing jail. However, there are more differences than meets the eye. For example, this is the old kitchen. Fremont County has been known to feed inmates TV dinners and pot pies. This is mostly due to how small this kitchen is. Take a look at this. This is the new kitchen. As you can see, dinners will be much better from now on. We now have a kitchen that we can serve prepared meals in versus our famous frozen pot pies and our frozen TV dinners. The new facility also has larger amounts of space. This is a cell in the old jail, and this is a pod in the new jail, allowing for many more inmates than there are currently. Members of the community share their thoughts on the needed upgrade. I think it's great, and I think the money was used in great ways. It's coming in more, more population, more people moving in, and it's going to be needed. And where we've been having to house people out of state, and we can hold or out of out of the county, this here will keep everybody here. It was really surprising. I loved like knowing every part of it, how they came in, um, how they had to check all of their stuff, and then the holding cells, and then going into the pods and just seeing their, where they stay and where they live in that. It was really interesting to be a part of that. Many also shared that they were impressed by the technology in the jail. The control room is amazing, so high tech, and just I love that they, the um, staff can know exactly what's going on throughout the whole jail. Just the space that they've used and what they've used the space for, and I think it'll be a good addition. I think it's going to be a really nice facility for holding people and to rehabilitate people, the young inmates and things like that. It looks like they got to put a lot of thought into it. In Fremont County for Local News 8, I'm Braden Wilson. Fremont County also shares that shares with us the new jail should be able to house a little over 40 inmates. They say a growing population along with the need for something newer contributed to the build. For more on this story, you can go to our website localnews8.com.